This is a 58-year-old female with a history of chronic left arm pain. The images demonstrate a T1 hypointense, stir heterogeneously hyperintense lesion centered within the medullary cavity of the left humeral diaphysis. Of note, there is no evidence of internal fat content on the out-of-phase images. There are nodular regions of diffusion restriction with heterogeneous enhancement. There is subtle endosteal scalloping without cortical breakthrough or associated soft tissue mass. The imaging characteristics are those of a chondroid lesion. Given the overall size and imaging appearance, conventional chondrosarcoma was favored and was found on biopsy. The differential also included enchondroma and most, much less likely bone infarct. Conventional chondrosarcoma is the most common subtype of chondrosarcoma. They may be low, intermediate, or high grade. They typically occur in the fourth and fifth decades of life with a slight male predominance. At the time of diagnosis, the lesion is usually over four centimeters in diameter. When arising in long bones, the lesions typically involve greater than 50% of the diaphyseal length. Typical clinical presentations include pain, palpable mass, and pathologic fracture.